the field. Chuck Sawyer. Bobby Link. John Hanks. And a bunch of, uh, we're a bunch of actors. Anyway, we'll introduce ourselves later. Anyway, uh, so welcome to our show. Hi, how's it going? Yeah, I know some of you people. I uh, appreciate you coming out. This is a show called Word Jazz. And um, <clears throat> the show is uh, going to be based on your suggestions, so we will be asking you for suggestions throughout the show. Um, and uh, we'll have kind of five episodes. Uh, in the middle of that, we'll have an intermission. Uh, if you need to uh, use the bathroom, you're welcome to do that. There'll, there'll be a little break, you know, obviously. Uh, bar's back there. Anyway, I, I, if you don't know how to wear a seatbelt, Here's how a seatbelt works, it goes <laughs> click. Um, anyway, uh, so we're, we're really happy to be here. Thanks, Sharp Nine, for having us. To get you in the mood for sharing your ideas, uh, we're going to have you give us some sample suggestions right now, all right? So on the count of three, I would like you to shout out your favorite Crayola crayon color. One, two, three. Purple. Sienna. Purple. Purple. Sorry, Sienna. It's too late for Sienna. But it is a great color. I prefer the burnt Sienna myself. Uh, that was very good. That was very good. Um, you should pat your, your neighbor on the back. Um, how about, uh, let's see, on the count of three, we'll do one more here. On the count of three, uh, something you got in trouble for in high school. One, two, three. Gosling! Excellent. I just heard video. I don't want to know anything else. So, uh, all right. Um, so, why don't you all go over here? Because I feel a little bit like you're about to be backup singers, um, which you're not. Um, we're going to uh, get our first suggestion that we're actually going to use here in just a moment. But I do want to remind you of our company motto, which is, if you laugh, we're doing comedy, and if you don't, we're doing drama. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Keep that in mind. You'll enjoy the show just that much more. So uh, the first tune you heard tonight was called Equinox, and the Equinox is, I believe, Sunday. And so what I would like to get from you is uh, something about the Equinox. Don't everybody shout at once. <laughs> you didn't count to three this time. No, I didn't. Yeah. I think I could count to three. Any, anybody anything? Mayan snakes. festivals. What's that? I heard Mayan what? Mayan snakes. Mayan snakes. OK. Um, I think the bar is selling hallucinogens. <laughs> it's a new Durham thing. Oh, it's not statewide. OK. Mayan, Mayan snakes, that's the first. And Pretty much the only thing I heard. Um, thank you for harvest. We'll see if we can fit that in. All right. We got we got some. All right. Can we play some Mayan music? <laughs> Because 
see the snakes in her heart. <laughs> Reservations. No, 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 no. I thought maybe okay. something more intimate at home okay. would maybe, okay. you know, be better for us. Yeah. Yeah. Sounds, sounds great. So mm -hmm. we're not going out? No, no, no. Okay. no. Actually, right. I think I have some friends coming here who you know, I'd like to introduce you to. You, you think you do? I think I do. Okay. I'm happy to meet your friends. I'm excited. Nice. This is kind of like, this right. is kind of turning into a thing, you know? Are you really excited? Uh, I'm super excited to meet your friends. Yeah. Wow, that's a great sound. Oh, that's even that. Yeah. Oh. I love it when you look at me that way. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
to say that I'm also interested in possibly bringing another person. Okay. Into the <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Uh, another person. Let me. I know. What is? Let me. Okay. Let okay. me just. You're right. Let me you're right. right. <laughs> Would this be another woman? <laughs> the people! You know what really creeps me out about them? saying, when you say this, I feel, and suddenly it's back on me, you know? So, do I know? <laughs> are we playing a game here, or, I mean, are we, are we kidding, or is this real? I'm just asking an honest question. Okay, and you have a crazy, batshit look in your eyes right now. <laughs> right? What do you mean by batshit? Like, batshit, like, I, uh, you know, I, I felt safe. With, I felt safe with you, and this is kind of like a side of you I, I have not seen befo before. <laughs> Stop. S -s 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 -s. This 
this is something new. A side I haven't seen. This is something new. If you know what I mean. I feel like my foundation's crumbling.
is a basket. And the ball's gonna fall into the basket. All right, go ahead and just to toss it. Just kind of throw it. There you go. That's good. Michael, I know you're distracted because your mother is ready. Nice. Well done. Great. Thank you, Dad. All right, do you want to try throwing the ball? Yeah, yeah. No. Oh. Okay. Here, I'll, I'll roll it to you. Oh, oh, that's a start. Well, I can teach you how to, okay, this is how you feel the pounder. You, you don't have to walk up to it, but here you go. All right. So we're going to be spending a lot of time together for a while because your mom left. Mom, mom is, um, well, she's, yes, she's sick. She's, um, she's dealing with some problems in her. Well, which is it? Is she sick or is she dealing with some problems? She's dealing with some problems that make her sick. So she's in a place where she can get some help. You know, so it's sort of like when you have your tonsils out. Only, um, it's her, um, her mind and her emotions. Did, 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 <laughs> did she get all the ice cream she wants? Um, I don't. I Is think that, she gets. I got all the ice cream I wanted when I when I when I when I when, 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 when I got my tonsils out. Yeah, you got lots of ice cream. Yeah. In fact, would you like to get ice cream tonight after after supper? Sure. Sure. All right. You're gonna have to eat all of your vegetables. Okay. So just after 11 years of this, it just suddenly it just started to look like a snake. It was a one-eyed snake, and I just I didn't want anything to do with it, quite honestly. <laughs> and now it thinks I'm mad. Does that make me mad? No, not wanting to cook breakfast and then do nothing all day doesn't make me mad. Thank you very much. I mean, I mean, I still love all those things, and I love my husband. It's just the one-eyed snake. I can't get the snake thing out of my mind. And now I can't touch him because it looks like this... Kind of, I don't know what. His hook? <sighs> I'm not talking about his forearm, darling. <laughs> and what am I going to do? I've slept with this man for 11 years, and now I'm just like, I'm just, what, what happened? I, just, I don't understand what happened. It's just this reptilian thing that I just don't, <laughs> you know, I'd rather pet to, I don't know what. <laughs> Would you rather pet, perhaps, <laughs> you know, I've been trying to figure out how to step my way back into liking the snake. Mm. Well, that's Maybe the a cat is the answer. I would say that there's a lot of pets to cat at this woman's retreat. So you risk coming out here to try something new and you know, see if maybe you could rekindle your flame with the snake or, or something else. You know, there's, there's nothing... Replace the snake with the cat. Exactly. You know, cats are soft and um, lovely. Watch your flowers, Wilma. Oh. Great. <laughs> how's it? How's it going? You know, um, I had a really great time at the retreat. You've really helped clear things up for me. Are you happy to see me, Wilma? Um, how are you doing? <laughs> What's been up with you? I'm here to see you. Do you want the flowers? I'm picking up this feeling like you don't want don't me here. Are you getting you along well with the other uh, patients? Oh, yes. Okay, good. Actually, I think that's been the best part of it. Mm -hmm. I'm getting along so well. You know, mm -hmm. I have so many um, close Close, close friends. Uh -huh. um, it's time for your medication. You can sit down. <laughs> Take this one. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What, what does this do? Just on her? Just, mm -hmm. You can keep talking. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. Oh, those are very I nice. Think, uh, just, I, why does this one look like morning? Base it, for the okay. flowers. <laughs> base. Good girl. You just look so nice holding them. Listen, 
called an oven. The top is a range. Why is it like I mean, it's called a stove. That's the oven. That's the range. Sorry, I got to get my, what? my nomenclature right. All right. You going to learn to cook. <laughs> <laughs> insulting to trades. I take it back. Maybe we should just go ahead and send you to college. Um, <laughs> Michael, oh, what, where you went away for a moment? I'm gonna learn to cook. It's hard. I'll read it in a book. This one right here. to me. Are you 
2024 all year round women's retreat. Yes! The one with the, 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 the Pilates um, and, and the and hey, uh, uh, what is, uh, uh, Let me guess, let me guess. Wil Wil Wilma? Yes, yes. Wilma. So it was right there on the tip of your tongue. Yes, we got it. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> How are you? You look, you look great. Yes. Well, I decided just to stop having a child. other mouths to feed. I was the littlest and the last and an afterthought. When my parents found out they were pregnant, they said they were surprised and delighted. I think they were surprised. <laughs> I didn't mind never getting the best of anything, always wearing hand-me-downs, not ever having my own room. What was I to do? I thought I would make tracks, I left home for a while, and it was even worse out there. <laughs> so I came back. all those brothers and sisters, 
two brothers, two sisters. Warm me down. Cell with one guy must seem like luxury to you. <laughs> I was an only kid. I'm freaking out. <laughs> What'd you do? I stole. I beat. I shot. I stabbed. <coughs> I mean, what? Everybody and everything. Okay. Had a lot of anger. Clearly. <laughs> was that all at one time, or was this a series of things, or what? Oh, it was a whole series of things. Uh, how are you finding things here at this <laughs> state facility? <clears throat> Lovely. Three hots and a cot. <laughs> Do people care about me? Or they fear me. All right. Which of you? Which of you? I haven't decided yet. I'll try caring for you. How's that? That's a good idea. We're all afraid of not being loved. <laughs> I suppose that's part of it. Now, you know, so fear can, uh, fear can motivate aggression. I was, I was very aggressive. I, uh, I killed some people. Let me ask you a question. But that's behind me now. Let me ask you a question. Whenever I forget, I do this. I'm gonna answer <laughs> behind. What you got? What's the question? <laughs> you ever wish you weren't born? Sometimes I do. Other times I'm I'm happy to be. Just that one. 
one thing. I mean, was it just one thing with you? No. I'm sure it wasn't. No. I'm sure you had older brothers and sisters to pick on you, didn't you? <laughs> yeah. No, no, no! Stop it! Your sister's gonna come over here right now. time so you can <laughs> just say something. I guess I guess I am glad I was born. No touching the inmates. <laughs> <laughs>
we're going to take a 10 minute intermission. Something about someone. Bubbly. What, what's that? Compassion. Bubbly. Compassion. Compassion. Wow, what a weirdo you are. <laughs> <laughs> what I love about coming to work on a Monday. <laughs> She's always there, my boss. 
I try to feed her there. I never, I've never, I swear, I think she might sleep there sometimes. She's always there. A smile that makes me feel safe and at home. When I'm at the office, I can't stop smiling. <laughs> because, I don't know, I've wrapped up so many points on my Steam account. <laughs> it just fills me with glee and, you know. She inspires the hell out of me. She works so hard. And she's a visionary, you know? So it's not just that she supports me and she catches me when I fall and she gives me helpful 360 degree feedback. Oh no, it's more than that. It's like, it's like, it's not like a trail of breadcrumbs. It's like a trail of cake. Really good cake. Stay over here. That's my side. <laughs> As you know, in the employee handbook, um, we are a compassionate company. What did I do? Just tell me what I did. You were not compassionate enough with someone who called customer service. <laughs> they did not feel acknowledged by you. <laughs> And it wasn't so much your words as your tone of voice. <laughs> Can you replicate? I'm going to play the tape for you right here. Okay. Welcome to customer service. How can I assist you? Mm -hmm. See, that's all you need for me to hear, right? You hear the red? There's like a little eh yeah, in there. There's, there's a little eh. A little, eh. Eh. A little yeah, rodent, right. yeah. rodent trying it to like... It was, a little, it was a little rude, wasn't it? No rodent, that's what I said. No, rodents can be, I, 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 I don't yeah. think rodents they, have manners one way or another. Well, when they come into your house and you don't want them to, I think that's okay. We're getting sidetracked. Okay, so, so okay, it's not I the admit. first time I'm going to play another <laughs> snippet here. And I think you'll agree this one is a little bit shocking. Thank you for making my day. <gasps> oh my God. <laughs> Was a little off that so you day. can see my hands are tied. <laughs> yeah, but that's only twice. Can I make it up? Can I? I mean, isn't there? I will oh, do it's better. Not just I'll twice. do better. <laughs> You're my favorite customer. Oh my! I'm so <laughs> I give myself to this place. I give and I give and I give. And you come and you shit on it. You shit on it.
feel deep inside, I let you down. Not just me. <laughs> all the people around. But give me a chance, will you? And I'll do Sometimes I feel like I'm talking about my stuff and you, you make it your stuff. <laughs> yeah, I do that. Does, it, does that seem healthy to you? Yeah, it seems healthy to me. <laughs> well, I feel like I want my own problems. I feel like I want to work through my own problems. All right, all right, go over them again. <laughs> okay. I, I feel like my dad when I, I don't feel like my father's ever been proud of me. Well, I understand that, yeah, probably. <laughs> you, you, you understand how it's difficult for me? <laughs> not, not, that's not what I mean, exactly. No. <laughs> I can understand why you might not have been proud of you. <laughs> that doesn't sound like you're taking on the problem. Now I feel like I'm... I mean, my dad was proud of me. <laughs> oh my God. Okay, yeah, that's no, more like it. Yeah, see, now that, that, that to me isn't really help, how, helpful. No, huh. not at all. No, no, no. 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 And, and, and I'm trying to be a, a better father to my son, so I tell him I'm proud of him all the time, and, and he doesn't believe me. <laughs> well, yeah. <laughs> Why, why would he believe you? <laughs> well, I mean, maybe it's too much. Maybe I say it too much. I don't know. Maybe. <laughs> okay, can I just sit here? Ah! Thank <laughs> you. 
to have it be a compassionate review. Compassionate review. <laughs> Could I compassion you with money? No. To write a better review? No. no, I really, really want to hear what was going on with you that made you make the choices you made, which I thought were uniformly misguided, hackneyed, <laughs> and um, just wrong. Uh, but maybe I'm missing something. Okay. Well, are you missing half of your brain? <laughs> that wasn't compassionate. That was mean. Well, I feel like you're being a little mean to me right now. I'm not. You're not? I'm being honest. Oh, okay. But, so you can be honest and be mean. You could be honest and be mean, I, I suppose, but I'm being honest and trying to be honest. I think you are missing half a brain. Honestly. <laughs> I just was telling you everything as honestly as I possibly could. Oh, you want to know how I really feel? I would love to know how you really feel. Okay. Okay? 
God, that was mean. I just said. Brian, your mother's upstairs crying. Jesus, Dad. Sorry. Wow, because you're abandoning Grula to your own mother. I just your just own flesh and blood. Oh, okay, 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 fine. I've got to, I came down to find more Kleenexes for her. Here, She's gone no, what she right here. Dad, here, 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 here. Uh, oh, thanks, sweetheart. You care. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, I, I care. I know you care. You just have moments where you just lose your patience. She just keeps repeating herself. No, honey, I know. And I say, no, that's not right. Your mother isn't here. I guess that's wrong. I'm sorry. I'll try to be better. Can you get her down here? No, I. Get, no, I want to talk to you about what you just said. Which what? better at this if you don't address the real problem. So what's the real problem? No, you tell me what the real problem is. I have is. no compassion. I have my I'm ideas just, about I'm what the real problem is. I'm a What do you mean? What, you know? <laughs> I want to talk seriously about I'm trying this. to. <laughs> I need to never be. Get her down here. I'll no, demonstrate now. No, you won't. This is old shit. <laughs> Brian, this is old shit. It's ancient. You, you always butted heads with her. It's not going to get better. She's not in a position to get better. I, I understand. It's really hard. She's got dementia. She's not going to. You've got to do some accepting, honey. None of this thing. Look, I don't think you're a bad person. It's just, it's. She's got to. You're right. No, I, I don't want to tell you what no, to you're, do. No, you're, you're right. <laughs> is ill. Yeah, mom's ill. She's not getting any better. I could talk to her, but maybe I should send her a letter. <laughs> she makes me crazy when I look her in the face. Mom's ill.
uh, an activity that a couple could get involved in together to rekindle some passion in their relationship. <laughs> Join the circus. Oh. Skinny dipping. Rebel. Skinny dipping. <laughs> still wearing your clothes. <laughs> A Mayan sacrifice must be nude. <laughs> I protest. <laughs> We're sacrificing you. What do you mean you protest? <laughs> there's, no, there's no appeal <laughs> in Mayan culture. I don't know much about it, but I want a second opinion. <laughs> Certainly you have a doctor. What? I am the doctor. Oh, I do everything here. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. I know. This is kind of small for an altar. But you're not going to be there long enough to get uncomfortable. So, do you know why we Mayans? Well, you notice I'm bringing this back because I feel guilty and it seemed not right to address this whole Mayan thing. But! Ah. Do you know why we sacrifice people? To, to save the, the whole tribe, the whole, all of our people. Of course. Good. I'm glad that's what you think. Right? Yeah, so, uh, hop on. Well, I hold on. I think you need a virgin. <laughs> We've done some thinking on this. And we've decided to take just guys like you. <laughs> because they are pleasing to the gods as well. And it's a lot more fun to have the, you know, around. <laughs> Look, I have these molds. Okay? I'm kind of, you know, like the sundial's getting a little, the shadow's getting a little longer, pal. It's like a point one. They're pretty easy to drop. Pretty much. All right. The beads, the beads. Don't get the beads. All right. Wow, you are not a beast for the eyes. Get on board. Face up. Oh. <laughs> 
You're saying like, let's get out of here. Maybe we should go, and then they follow well, us, and they heard you say like, skinny dipping. So I was like, let's be part get of that. Out of here. Right. You know, if, if you take your stuff off. Yeah. No problem. Yeah. Oh. Wow. Oh, wow. We wow. Um. <laughs> down here, Ned. You bring any batteries? Well, yeah, I brought batteries there in the car. All right, all right. What do you see? I don't see this is much not anything. I thought I heard some tittering. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I did too. That's that, that was that that's was def, that that's was tittering. That was yeah. <laughs> three bob. Yeah, three bob. They gotta be around here somewhere. What the hell was that? <laughs> Ned, I got an idea. Good, cause I got nothing. We're gonna use you as bait. What? We're gonna use you as bait. You get out of your uniform and you go down there and you get in the water with them. And now, how's that work, exactly? <laughs> I think there might be a lot of screaming and stuff. <laughs> and, God, this is scary. <laughs> I got a confession to make. Yeah, yeah. And I don't want to make you feel uncomfortable, but I feel plenty uncomfortable not expressing my feelings. <laughs> okay, now I'm too comfortable. I want to see you nude. <laughs> I 
dude. That's why.
Denver and Carborough for our Day of the Dead show. Thanks for coming out, everyone. Thank you.